Hey, welcome to Grandpa's World. Grandpa here. Today yeah, we're back in California again. Over time, aliens have used a variety of UFOs to come visit our wonderful planet. They still seem to enjoy coming here to visit our people, our surroundings. Many people have seen odd things. Some can be explained, some can't. This is Patrick's story. He was in the United States Marine Corps at Camp Pendleton, California. His platoon was out in the field training while the pilots were doing bomb dropping train, training missions as they were all out in the middle of nowhere with no power lines, no fences, no nothing. They all saw an orb. It was round, red, glowing, hovering. It was just sitting there watching them. After a few minutes, they saw it take off, leaving a red trail behind them. Okay. Story number two. Harold's story is a little bit different. He saw a, a UFO, but his story starts about two weeks before the sighting. He said he started hearing voices. He doesn't tell us what the voices were saying to him. He just knew that they were coming soon. It was on Sunday around 3.45 when he felt strongly to go to the mall. So he went a different route and went to the back way. As he pulled in the parking lot, he saw a lot of people standing under a UFO, which was hovering about 20 feet above the mall's roof. Harold had already decided not to go with the UFO if he had the option. So while the group stood there for a few minutes, Harold realized that there was no movement, no air, no sound, no heat. All of a sudden, the UFO disappeared in a millisecond. He doesn't believe anyone was abducted and the communication was, say to, so to say, volunteer. Harold has looked for years to see if anyone else had said anything about it. That's all for Grandpa's World today. Have a good one. We'll see you later.